Hi, Internet and Casey. This is Melly with 25 and 52. Uh, I've been just pretty exhausted for a lot of the time lately, so I haven't been doing a lot of the side things that I normally talk about on here. Um, last weekend, I made like 40 meatballs. It was pretty great. Um, I, after a lot of like, <laughs> Um, about stuff. I finally found an egg-free recipe um, and thought I had gluten-free breadcrumbs, but then I didn't. But then it turns out you can use instant, instant polenta instead, and that actually turned out pretty delicious. So I might do that again because I usually have it, and why bother keeping breadcrumbs around if, you know, they're only for meatballs. It was my first time also using flax meal as a fake egg thing, um, and it's a really good you know, substitute. It's got the like weird uh, goopy texture, which is exactly what you want it for for things like meatballs. <laughs> On Saturday, I took the GRE and it was exhausting. Like, I forgot how much four, three or four hours of testing can just like wipe you out for the rest of the day. Just no. <laughs> I had plans, I ditched them, and I laid on that couch and did nothing for quite a while, and it was great. It was really, really great. I got a really good score though, so that's awesome. Um, so this is silly, but I'm really glad that TV shows are coming back around again because, you know, I, I like having TV shows to watch and Elementary's airing actually tonight, but I won't be able to watch it tonight. And that's one of my favorites. Um, I've started watching the Sleepy Hollow thing. It's really entertaining. Let's go with entertaining. Um, the cinematography, particularly in the first episode, was a lot of, like, the camera guy having a lot of it being like, Wee! Trick shots upside down! Oh my god, my body has been hurting for, like, three days. It's obnoxious. But, you know, it doesn't- at least it doesn't hurt bad enough that I have to stay home from work. Like, typing is fine, it's just... annoying. <laughs> um, maybe someday I'll be healthy. That would be pretty cool. In the meantime, I am doing things like making meatballs so that there's food around that's, um, you know, like freezer food that is 100% guaranteed to not make me flare up because I know exactly what went in it and everything is fine. Because uh, sometimes what happens is I start out being like this and then I'm like, I don't want to chop things, I don't want to be standing in front of a stove, and I end up not cooking for a while and so I eat a lot of gluten, which makes my body be like, oh, I don't like this, I don't like you and inflammation everywhere, and then my body hurts for a while. And then I don't want to cook, because my body hurts. And you see where this is going. But, you know, we solve that problem, and then it gets unsolved, and then I solve it again, and it gets unsolved. So I think I'm back on the, like, train of solving it, so, you know, my legs can stop hurting any day now, and that would be really cool. Someone I follow on Twitter uh, has goats, and one of the goats had babies yesterday, and the pictures and like little Instagram video things are really cute. Maybe I will post a link. Anyway, I love you and I'm looking forward to seeing you in less than a month. Because next week is October. Oh my god. <laughs> Bye.